Alright guys, welcome back to J Force Gaming and as you guys know, accidental foul deletion is a very common thing and can happen to anyone and everywhere and at any time, alright? One of the most common factors is when you are using an external storage drive and instead of, you know, um, removing it directly from Windows, alright, you just pull it straight out of the USB drive and it can cause data corruption or accidental data corruption and all the time we when we delete things to clear our storage space, we also accidentally deleted some of of the font memories that we have really important pictures or important documents for submission all right well if that happens most of the time it's unrecoverable and you have to bring it to a specialist for them to recover it for you and it'll cost you a lot of money and your privacy is not protected what if i tell you there is another way today that you guys can recover at the comfort of your own home in less than five minutes and get your data or recovered or even those deleted from the recycle bin well, how do I do that? Well, it is with the help of this software right here. So this is the 4DDIG Windows Data Recovery software. All right, and trust me, this thing has saved me so much time. All right, so as you know, as a content creator, I do a lot of you know recording, filming, and a lot of different footage, different B rolls. All right, and most of the time, sometimes I may do accidental deletions because I want to clear my storage space for other you know videos, and some of the times, all right, and it happens to me many times. All right, where there is like accidental data deletion or corruption on my data when I pull it out too fast or when I accidentally deleted the rest of the video with the unwanted videos and you know most of the time it's unrecoverable and most I'm sometimes you know it's because of window crashes and happen really really often especially if you're using Windows 11 you should have faced this issue where you know Windows crashes are quite often and some of the unsafe work or you know data is accidentally deleted because of the Windows crash and most of the time all right without this software help I have to either reflame it or I have to re-record it and it can takes me up so much much time but with this software i can just plug it in my external storage or my hard disk all right and it can help me recover all the things that got accidentally deleted and it's such a lifesaver all right and it's super super reliable super safe to use i'm using it for many years without any issues so right now i'm going to show you guys the software itself and i'm going to do a quick demonstration on how you guys can uh, actually recover deleted files where i'm going to delete a file all right right in front of you and after that i'm going to recover it directly through the software itself so without further ado let me just go ahead and show you guys the software itself let's go all right so as you guys can see this is the software itself you guys can see this is my c drive so i'm going to go touch that because it contains my windows drive so this is a pretty important drive all right so what i'm going to demonstrate on is my external drive which i have right here it's a 30 gigabytes drive all right and um yeah and uh, let me just go through with you the other parts of software so they do not only have you know recover from you know local drive you can also recover from uh, external drive right? i'm going to show you later on the demonstration all right you can also do sd card recovery video recovery cloud drive you can also recover data from a crash pc and this thing has happened to me once where my pc is starting to stop working i have no idea why all right but i really need to retrieve the data because it contains all the inf important information files inside my that pc which is unable to boot so i can use this software from another pc like my laptop all right to recover the so the lost file so it's really really useful it happens to me once you can also do video photo repair if there's any corruption to the videos and like like I say when I pull my uh, SD card or my USB drive out too fast from Windows, alright, it may cause corruption. I can also use this to do repair and, uh, and they have other tools as well, alright. So right now I'm gonna just go ahead and um, recover the files. So right now if I go to my um, USB D drive, you guys can see, alright. So this is my USB D drive, alright. You guys can see, alright. We have a PDF files right over here. We have a room background image. I can just show you guys. This is the one that I used <laughs> at the start of the video, alright. And we have a, a one of the video that I recorded not long ago all right and uh, we have a uh, pdf documents over here all right so um yeah just a random pdf document so these are the files you guys remember that all right so right now we are going to delete them okay so yeah so what i'm going to do is imagine i have i've recorded this video and you know if i if we were to get deleted what will happen so i i take probably like two hours to record this video and i'm just going to delete it right now boom okay it's gone all right so uh, there is no way of recovering it and all my two hours of recording that video is totally gone so if i open up my disk drive and i go back to my usb d the d drive it is empty right now completely empty there's no way of recovering back if i were to show you my recycle bin you guys can see this is my recycle bin and it's also empty at all so there is no way of recovering my data back at no, anymore all right so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to use this thing all right to scan and recover my files all right 
All right, and then I get to choose you know, what type of file I want to recover. So if you have, you know, what type of specific file you want to recover, you can just select the file. For, when, first, for example, if I want to just recover the video file itself, I just have to select the video. So it will make the scan time much faster. You don't have to scan the whole entire drive, all right? You can just, you know, select the specific one. All right, so for me, just want to remember that it's a PDF document. So we're going to select a document. We do have a video as well, and we do have an image. So we're going to just keep on other things right here and we just scan the selected file types all right so we're gonna just like do the advanced scanning all right and we guys can see all right it has already found all right remember the the, the pdf name pickering labs yep it already found it but i don't know why there's two copies of this but and we have a room background right here you guys can see it's already found it all right you already found my lost files look at that Alright, it's all over here and we do have like, you know, this is the one that I've deleted just now, you guys can see. Alright, these are the files that I actually deleted and it has been found. Alright, you guys can see. Alright, so I can recover them. Alright, so I can just select them. Alright, I don't have to even um, do anything to it, alright. So it's really, really fast. So if you know like a specific files that you want to edit on, alright, uh, sorry, you have a specific file you want to recover, alright, it will scan much faster. So I don't have, I can just stop the scanning, but if I want to continue, alright, you have found like, you know, way more. So if I go to like JPEG, you see, some other files that is not even existed, right? some of the way older files that I can see, alright, you have been finding all the way older files. Well, if I let you scan you 100%, alright, you see, it's already found 19.37 gig, but in my that drive, that is nothing at all. So basically, these are all like the lost binary files, you know, like when you delete a files, it's not fully deleted, as you guys have known, alright. So you can hear there's even PNG files over here. I love that you guys can preview it. Some of the files can be previewed, some cannot be previewed, but it can be recovered. Look at all the files, all right? Some I have no even no idea why is there so many images. So yeah, basically I've been using this drive for many years already. So you have files like existed like way, way before that you can see. All right, there is this image over here that can be previewed as well. All right, um, yeah, it just shows a preview here. But I don't know why here doesn't show, but yeah, you, can, you guys can see from here. All right, just wait a while for Lay to load the preview. But yeah, there is a preview and some of the images, like some of the game thing that I did like probably many years ago. And you guys can see the Photoshop itself, the Photoshop document as well. WDP document, look at that, look at that. We have so many kinds of files that have been deleted by me many years ago and they are recovering it back. Look at how incredible this thing is, all right? It's, it's really, really incredible. I right, have um, M, M, M4V file, all right? You can see even this preview. I think this is the one that I, um, quite some time ago, all right? Look at this. All right, all the files right over here, all right? We even have FBX file. This is like the um, 3D game object file. That's something I use for um, game development. And um, yeah, all the... 3D objects files all over here. We're gonna stop the scanning for now because we have already found back the files that we want. If you guys remember, all right, if I go to lost file, all right, it is the Pickering Labs, all right, Pickering Labs catalog, all right, and the room background, and as well as, um, I don't know why there's three, but I'm gonna just do one, all right. If this one doesn't recover, you can just, just choose other two, all right, and there is also the tube skit location changer. So once I'm done with it, I can just click on Recover, so these are three files that was deleted. So I can recover it back to the USB drive I want to. All right, so once I click on the USB drive, I want to recover it to. You guys can choose where you want to recover it to, and they also have a cloud drive as well. So you guys can recover it to your Google Drive or OneDrive or Dropbox. I'm going to just recover it to the USB drive that I deleted. All right, I just click on Save now. I just click on Save Anywhere. All right, and there is also... um. The they also detected some damaged files, so you can just recap, repair and recover, all right, and um, yeah, you can just let it finish, all right, repairing and recovering. Okay, so if I were to go to the, um, the drive again, this PC, USB drive D, you guys can see the recovered file is right over here, so it's labeled as a folder for DDIG, the date and the time, so I just click on that, D drive, lost files, all right, and you guys can see it. His boom is back, all right? All the catalog, the room background image, and the location changer video is finally back. So two hours of my time has been recovered. So yeah, that's how incredible it is, all right? In recovering lost files, all right? So um, yeah, so this is a really, really reliable and really, really useful 
data recovery tool and the best part is you guys can also sort it by you know by the date the time and um the file type as well so that it's like you know a it make it convenient for you to search for the specific file that you want in like a sea of you know files that you have been used and deleted throughout the years all right because it can be a lot a lot of data all right so actually if my this drive is 32 gig if i were to do full scan of it all right it probably contains over like maybe two to three hundred gigabytes of data that have ever been written on that drive before so it's really crazy all right so there's many the amount of files that it has all right so yeah you guys can you guys can see it's a legitimate all right data recovery software no any gimmicks all right you guys can see i deleted it straight and there's no way of recovering back but by using this software i can actually recover back all the deleted files which is really really incredible so yeah if you guys want to check out this all right 40 drg windows data recovery you guys can check out the first link in the video description down below and get this software for yourself right now and it, and it's really really more worth it all right compared to you know bring to a specialist where your privacy is not protected because you can see you can see all the files that you've been using it throughout the years and probably they are probably using the same software all right to recover your file so why do you pay the extra to give your file to a to give your hard disk or hard drive or your storage to a stranger where they can look through all the files that you have on it before all right and um yeah and charge you an absurd amount of price where you guys can save way more by getting this software itself and doing it at the comfort of your own home where you are the only one that can see what you have on your disk drive so yeah you guys can do all this without the saving the hassle and all that all right and you guys can you know recover anytime wherever you want so anytime you actually delete something just like you just put up this software and start recovering your file so you don't have to go make multiple trips to the data recovery specialist just to get your data recovered so you know save way more protect your privacy and you guys can recover anytime whenever you do any accidental deletion so it's a win-win situation for you so why not get this software right now to recover your deleted and important files that you have all right right now safely and reliably so once again go check out this all right then i share 40 gig data recovery all right you guys can check out the first link in the video description down below and get this for yourself right now all right and trust me i'm using this for so long i don't have any issues don't run to any issues or the thing is that all the thing this software does is help me save a lot of time and a lot of trouble. So yeah, so that's all for today guys. And if you guys liked today's video and did help you recover your deleted files and stop your panicking, you guys can let me know in the comment section as well. And do give it a thumbs up. And without further ado, this is JForce Gaming and I shall see you guys in my next video. Peace out. I don't wanna cry.